Clipping paths cut photos and illustrations into shapes. You can use text objects or vector objects as your clipping path. Effectively, whatever shape is on top is going to cut through below. Let's make an extra copy of this circle. I'll show you why in a second, but I want to keep all of its properties. I want to use its shape to cut through, and I want to keep this in behind. Let me pull this all the way to the front, clicking bring to front. I'll select all of these objects, and I'll choose object, clipping path, make. Great, so it, that shape cut through those objects below. If I want to keep using my shape, I can send that to the back, and here's the object I'm looking for. Again, you can use this with text as well to cut through the object below. Object, clipping path, make. Great! Note that you can always adjust your objects, even though they're involved in a clipping path. And you can even change their colors.